Hello everyone, so uh, as you can see I've got a bit of a problem uh, in my tank with uh, black beard algae or hair algae as some people call it. Um, it's all over the back of my tanks, all over the rocks as well, although the rocks I have treated with a, a solution, took the rocks out and gave them a little bit of a, a rinse off the other day. Uh, but it's the plants I really want to um, get this hair algae off of, this black beard algae off of. Um, especially because I want to transport these into the sump into the main fish room so I've done some uh, research on YouTube and uh, seen some people using hydrogen peroxide so I bought myself some of that and a little spray bottle I've already got and I've sprayed this one plant here uh, with some hydrogen peroxide and a little bit of the back uh, ground of the tank as well so I'm going to do a video over the next few days, see whether it has any effect, see whether it gets rid of this hair algae, or this black beard of hair algae, and um, we'll take it from there. So this is uh, day two of trying to treat the black beard um, hair algae um, on my plants. So I treated it with some hydrogen peroxide yesterday, I'm going to do another dose today, I'm going to use a syringe today. Uh, rather than a spray bottle because I think with a spray bottle it uh, as, you, as soon as you spray what it's doing is it's uh, allowing the liquid out but it's also putting air back in the bottle um, and uh, when it's underwater all it's doing is sucking aquarium water in there so it's actually diluting the hydrogen peroxide so I'm going to use a syringe uh, which you can get with most uh, medicines these days for kids um, you have a little syringe or you can get it on, uh, on eBay or, or any of the other websites readily available so it's just a, a normal plastic syringe and I'm going to spray this plant here uh, with that so this is day two so, so interestingly I sprayed the uh, hydrogen peroxide on this uh, black beard hair algae just a few seconds ago you can always see that there's a uh, um, some air bubbles around where I sprayed so that's obviously you know, the same on that one as well because I've done both leaves so I'll be interested to see what actually happens now over the course of the next few days now this plant here hasn't been treated at all with hydrogen peroxide so I've got uh, two plants in here one which I am treating one which I am not so I just want to see again just uh, see whether there's any change in, in the the hair algae growing on this plant as well even though I haven't directly sprayed it so it's day three of the uh, hydrogen peroxide treatment in this tank um, I think uh, as you can see the leaves are looking a little bit cleaner the hair algae still hasn't gone it's dying a nice reddish color though so perhaps that's all it's going to do um, on this plant here I took the plant out of the water completely and sprayed it in the air with the hydrogen peroxide as well um, and that made that go brown or reddish very quickly so I'm hoping that's all going to die off but uh, we'll see how it goes but I'm going to now give it another treatment and uh, see you on uh, day four, day five so this is day five of the hydrogen peroxide treatment um, the hair algae is still on the plants it has changed colour slightly but it's still on there but I would say that the condition of the leaves has definitely improved um, this plant over here I took out and treated directly with the hydrogen peroxide um, that certainly got rid of any other type of algae but the hair algae has gone like a reddish tinge to it as you can see um, again it's still not come off but I only treated that yesterday for the first time so I think there is a, an improvement uh, whether it's a marked improvement with hair algae um, is yet to be determined so I'm going to treat again and we'll be back on day six so here we are on uh, day seven of the hydrogen peroxide treatment on my plants uh, to remove the black beard hair algae um, you can see um, this is having an effect I took this plant out completely yesterday out of the water and sprayed it um, outside the tank and then put it straight back in the tank um, I think it's definitely made a difference to reduce the amount of hair algae that's growing around the edges of the leaves there. Um, I've never seen this plant looking as quite as good as this to be fair. 
um, all the algae on the surface of the leaf has definitely gone and it's looking really bright so uh, I'm very pleased with the way this is turning out so this is the second plant which I treated as well and as you can see there's been a huge reduction in the air hair algae on the outside of this leaf uh, which is really good news um, so yeah I think this is the treatment definitely worth pursuing so uh, if you do have a problem with um, black beard hair algae like this then give hydrogen peroxide a, a go but be very careful when handling it um, it can be toxic on the skin so uh, uh, just be very careful uh, the, the stuff I'm using is 12% hydrogen peroxide um, so and it will go inert in the fish water as well so you can spray it in the water and it just turns into water and extra oxygen bubbles in the water will just disperse off the surface so there's certainly no issues with uh, it damaging your fish or anything like that uh, hi guys so here we are on day 12 uh, of the hydrogen peroxide treatment on the black beard hair algae as you can see it is having quite a difference on on the uh, algae itself it is removing it now which is great um, so I'm going to continue treatment until that's all gone um, on this plant over here where I sprayed it outside the aquarium and then put it back and, and then continue treatment you can see there's only a very small amount of hair algae growing on there now um, so again um, I think the conclusion of this test is yes hydrogen peroxide does actually work it does actually remove black beard hair algae from your plants and uh, to be honest I think this is probably the best condition I've seen these plants in a very 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 long time so uh, that's great news okay thanks for watching cheers so here we are day 13 now this uh, this this is definitely going all this uh, black beard hair algae as I mentioned yesterday it's uh, getting better and better every single day and this plant is looking well a million times better than what it did about two weeks ago so uh, yeah this this is definitely working got my Maratus just coming into the picture there um, so yeah that's definitely working this plant is now virtually clear there's only a very very small bit of uh, hair algae there now um, but that plant is clear and I shouldn't think it'll be long before this one is clear as well which was the worst out of the two plants so yeah this is uh, I can highly recommend the hydrogen peroxide treatment once a day